Telegraph now, Leo, and our favourite online safety bill has the Andrew Tates of this world in its sights. Yeah, so misogynistic abuse online is set to be banned under plans drawn up in the House of Lords. Sorry, Lewis, you're yeah. going to have to go back to the old-fashioned misogynistic abuse. No more online <laughs> stuff. So online spaces are still a wild west for women and girls, according to Baroness Morgan. Uh, but they'll, they'll like that, women, because uh, the horses... Yeah. Yeah, and rugged <laughs> cowboys. But this is, I mean, the, the online safety bill is going gonna, is gonna, to uh, make it the, the duty of social media companies to deal with yeah. anything that's perceived to be misogynistic abuse. And they'll face fines worth up to 10% of their global turnover. And oh bosses, my God, 10% of could, their global turnover. That's a huge amount of money. That, yeah. that could make them, I mean, this is, this is before profit. That's, yeah. you know, that's before they've made any profit. And a lot of these companies are very marginal or not making any profit anyway. And also bosses could be jailed for, for up to two years. So it'll make social media companies very risk averse and they'll police what's said very carefully because how do you judge what's misogynist well there's i don't think there's almost i can't imagine there's any way of them successfully policing it without yeah. without kind of just like having such an incredibly blunt instrument that you would post a tweet with the word bitch in it talking about your labrador <laughs> and, and and you'll lose your account or whatever you know yeah. i mean the the misogyny thing as well seems to be bubbling up and getting hammered down again and again lately there's been all sorts of attempts to make it a, a new category of hate crime yeah and that and that failed. There's been attempts to make wolf whistling from scaffolding into a into a hate crime, and that's. But do you know what I mean? They keep yeah. kind of finding a way to try and get. But it, it doesn't through. matter. This is not about misogyny. This is about state censorship, state control. It's about more Ofcom fingers into everything. This is. I think if you live, in, Britain is such a. I'm not going to say it's a great country because I don't think. Whatever. It's a very good country. I love it. But what's great about this country is not state control. There's too much state control. That's every it's country. It's almost, you know what it is? It's almost like there's no First Amendment in this country. <laughs>